I know that you sang some Led Zeppelin, you know, covers when you're in high school. Oh yes. I mean, how did your opera teacher feel about that? Was, were you ruining she your wouldn't voice? be happy. She wouldn't be happy. She probably wouldn't be happy with what I'm doing now either. You know, operatic singing is mostly it's a sort of a it's literally a, a pillow of air directly into your head. That this it's the, the theory is that you don't use your throat. It's that sound passes through. It's a medium, and that you know any abuse on the vocal cords is anything from yelling, talking loud, being in a room full of smoke. I mean, it's the vocal cords are very sensitive. So my teacher probably wouldn't have, you know, if I was doing this or Led Zeppelin or whatever, would probably have not liked it. I could do like Mariah Carey style and, and you know, have 50 humidifiers everywhere I go. And that like would be... White ribs, live in a bubble. Live in a bubble and have, you know, moist towels dripped in honey around my neck and things Is like that. that. What she does? Do you know no, I think actually I heard that about Pavarotti. Really? It was that he walked around with moist towels around his neck. That could be a complete fabrication, but um, I uh, yeah, t it's just not very nice on the vocals. But you just have to be smart, you know. Don't mm -hmm. smoke, either don't smoke at all or don't smoke too much. Um, make sure sleep. For me, sleep is the most important. If I lose mm -hmm. sleep, I lose my voice. <laughs>